I'm here in an Uber with my driver, George. And you know, millions of people take rideshare every day to get to restaurants, the gym, even appointments. But now a new trend is emerging. Some sick people are calling an Uber or Lyft instead of an ambulance to get to the ER. It's a sign of the times. More and more people calling an Uber or Lyft for a ride to the emergency room. Skipping the more expensive and sometimes slower to respond ambulance. You think you might be having a baby. Yeah. yeah. And you took an Uber car. Well, I didn't have a ride. Yeah. Okay. So... You don't want your water to break in your own car. Yeah. yeah. No. Drivers say it's becoming a trend. Have you ever taken anybody to the emergency room? All the time. <laughs> All the time. All the time. Chandra Steele knew she needed to get to the ER fast. I was having some internal bleeding. A New Yorker, Chandra tried hailing a taxi, but someone else grabbed it first, so she called for an Uber. I was very anxious when I was in there. I was anxious about my medical condition overall. I was, I did have concern for the driver as well. I didn't want to panic him. They got to the hospital and everything turned out fine, but not all drivers are happy to transport sick and injured people. On a driver forum, one wrote about a passenger who wanted to go to the ER with a badly cut hand. They didn't want to get blood in their car, so they called an Uber. I said no thanks and drove off. Some doctors warn taking a ride share to the ER could be a risky ride. Do you have concerns about patients coming in in a ride share instead of an ambulance? Well, this is not a medical transport vehicle, so if a person is having a life-threatening emergency, there's no better way to get that care than from a paramedic. In a statement to NBC, Uber writes, Uber is not a substitute for law enforcement or medical professionals. In the event of a medical emergency, we encourage people to call 911. But a ride share to the ER worked for Chandra Steele. I, of course, gave him five stars and wrote a nice, a nice little note with it. One other benefit, rather than waiting months to get a hefty ambulance bill, patients tell us they know exactly what that trip will cost them to the ER. And even with surge pricing, it's a lot less than an ambulance ride. Back to you guys. All right, Tammy, thank you very much. I don't know about no, no, that. No. Especially if you bleed in their car, they're going to give you a bad rating. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, That's exactly. a one-star <laughs> ride right there. Right. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.